All right, guys, welcome back to Banana Lasers Horror Trivia Challenge. Let's see who is going to be victorious this time between Alex Edwards and Dave Z, Banana Laser's own. Uh, let's see, last time Alex was the winner. Wait, I'm uh, Banana Laser's own too. Yeah, that's what dude. I said. Well, that's what I meant. Oh, okay. Alex Edwards <laughs> and Dave Z's Banana Laser's own. Yeah. Oh, okay. You, okay. As yeah. long as I'm included. Yeah. yeah but... <laughs> <laughs> the skeleton crew guy is still here. <laughs> you, you just snuck in. You just snuck. We left the door open by accident, and you won't leave. God damn it. Uh, so, yeah, let's do this again. We did it the last show. I think it was pretty fun. I think you guys had a good time. So let's just run down the rules really quick in case anybody has no idea what the fuck we're talking about. This is a trivia game between Dave and Alex. Uh, what's going to happen is we're going to start with one contestant. going to read them a question pertaining to Friday 13th or Nightmare on Elm Street. And we're going to alternate uh, between Dave and, and Alex. Uh, we're going to go through five rounds and each round the questions will get more and more difficult and as such they'll be worth more points but this time guys we've altered the rules slightly for these two dipshits here first of all uh, I'll ask a question I'll give the guys 10 seconds to answer it off the top of the dome and if they do it's worth double points after the 10 seconds, they'll have multiple choice answers to choose from, and it'll be worth normal points. Also, instead of the guys picking which movie franchise that they want to do, we'll just do, because they hate Nightmare on Elm Street, go, go figure. Uh, <laughs> we're going to do two questions from Friday the 13th series, then we'll do one question from the Nightmare series. That way it's, you know, it's, a, it's an even mix that these guys can... can uh, Enjoy. So yeah, and this way we don't have to be such good sports, like, right? Yeah. yeah, or dicks. Yeah, start being you know get competitive, you yeah. fucks. You know, I mean, you, if, do you want to choose the next movie in a rolling through the seventies? Yes. Come on. Yes, we do. Yeah, I really do. I want to do another Dracula versus Frankenstein. <laughs> <laughs> I think there is another Dracula on the next and next year. Yeah, there is. Oh, boy. Um, <laughs> all right, so let's get this shit started. Uh, let's see who won last time, Alex. So. Yeah. Uh, let's, let's start with Alex. All right, so, Alex, are you ready? Mm-hmm. Okay, here we go. We'll start you off with a softball here. <clears throat> From Friday the 13th. Okay, here we go. Rennie, one of two survivors of Friday the 13th Part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan, encountered young Jason as a child. Yes. Woo! <laughs> True, that is correct. So that is worth 10 points. Excellent. Good job. Booyah! Thank All right, Dave Z, are you ready for your question? Yeah, I think, I, I think I'm ready. All right, another true or false question here, buddy. The events of Friday the 13th took place on what would have been Pamela Voorhees' birthday. True or false? False. That is correct. And that for anyone listening, that was Jason's birthday. In case you didn't know. All right. So now, Alex, the dreaded nightmare on Elm Street question. Ugh. True or false, A Nightmare on Elm Street was the first feature film produced by New Line Cinema. I think it is the first one they made themselves, that studio, so I'm going to say yes. Woo! All right! All right! That is correct. Yes! Boom, another 10 points. Hitting them out of the park as usual. All right, Dave Z, last question in round one. In Friday the 13th, part four, the final chapter, what did Ted find in the cupboard? In the cupboard? What did Ted find in the cupboard? Oh, I know what he found. Fucking those porno movies. Those skim there... flips. Stag flips. Whatever. <laughs> Woo! All right! Woo! All right! Yep. Oh, yeah. A oh, stag nice. film. I'm glad yes. you said stag, too. That was awesome. There we go. All Took right, me so. just a second. I was thinking of the corkscrew. 
You know, <laughs> that was right. like a famous line. That's you know? what I was thinking of. Ted, where the hell's the cork crew? <laughs> <laughs> so how many points is that? Is that 20 points? 20 each. Exactly. Yep. Both got 20 each to round out round one. Now we're back to Alex with another Friday question. This time it's from round two, so it's going to be a little harder. Which other surviving member of Tommy Jarvis's family did not return in Friday the 13th, Part 5, A New Beginning? Trish Jarvis. Woo! All right! Woo! All right! Uh, that is correct. You went uh, the extra mile because it just says his sister, so good job. <laughs> nice. Uh, <laughs> All right, so that's worth 20 points. Uh-oh. Excellent. Trish, party tonight! <laughs> All right, skinny dip. All right. <laughs> All right, Dave. Here we go okay. from your favorite Nightmare on Elm Street film, The Dream Master Part Four. Oh, fuck. Okay. Who died in his waterbed? Oh, that's easy. Joey. Woo! All right. Boom, man! You guys are good. That's awesome. I see. I would have. I would have failed on it. On any any time you got to recall a name, I would fail. So only, I'm glad really? I'm on this end. Uh, only because, believe me, if it wasn't King Kate or Joey, only because they're from Part Three. If it would have been one of the new characters, done. Right. I got lucky. Mm, Dan, huh? That's somebody. All right. So Alex, back to you, sir, with a Friday the Thirteenth question. Here we go. During Friday the 13th, how do you keep getting these? Friday the 13th, part 8, Chasing Six Manhattan. <laughs> Damn. A street gang challenged Jason to a fight until they saw what? His face, motherfucker! Woo! All right! Woo! All right! Oh, it's correct. His dick! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and then they that... smelled it. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to fight him until I smelt his dick. <laughs> God. All right, Dave, here we go from your favorite Friday the 13th film. Uh-oh. Okay. A Six? new beginning. Uh. <laughs> no. mm-hmm. uh, where did Robin find Jake dead? Where did Robin find Jake dead? Huh. In bed. Woo! All right! Woo! All right! 20 points to Dave. Yeah. Good job. I figured it was just in bed, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Tied neck and neck. After round two, boop, 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 boop. you both got 60 points. Good job, guys. Woohoo! Banana laser wins every time. Okay, moving on to round three. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> uh, potentially worth 30 points. Here we go. In oh. Freddy versus Jason, what was the first thing Freddy said to Lori during her final nightmare? Oh, come hmm. on. The first thing he said during the final one? Who the fuck would know that? Right? Nobody. <laughs> John, Johnny Gore, maybe? Right, right. This isn't multiple choice? It is, oh, but okay. I was giving you the 10 seconds. No, I have to go multiple yeah, choice. Seconds. I might get okay. it. Okay, here we go. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I'll get Drink it some, now. Take some more smart juice. There you go. <laughs> okay. Is it A, Sweet Dreams Bitch? B, You're in My World Now? C, What's Wrong, Lori? Miss Your Wake Up Call? Or D, Rise and Shine? That is so easy. Because it jogged my memory like I ran around the fucking block at sea. Woo! All right! Woo! All right! There you go. Yes. What's wrong, Lori? Miss your wake-up call. All right. So that's 15 points. Not bad. Yep. No, that, no that's okay. I wouldn't have known that. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't have got that either. No. All right, Dave Z, back to you with a Friday the 13th question. In Friday the 13th, Part 2, which counselors snuck off to Camp Crystal oh, Lake? come on. 
Jeff and Sandra. The fuck, dude? Are you sure this is the right round? <laughs> that's the easiest thing in the. No, seriously, come on. We all know that's the easiest thing in the world. Correct. <laughs> Boom. Thirty points to Dave. I'm At least to... you got a Freddy vs. Jason question and not a Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah. There you he go. Has you, Alex. Yeah. All right, Alex. Back to you, sir. Here we go. Not including the killer, how many people were murdered Shit. during? Friday the 13th, Part 7, A New Blood. How many people were murdered? Dude, I have to get a paper and a pen here. <laughs> I know, who, right? who would know this? <laughs> Multiple I, I choice could. would know it. That's about it, yeah. I Off could do it. No, nobody could. Okay, hold on. Star mummy girl, <laughs> pig girl, redhead, black person, black. Person. Okay, your multiple choice <laughs> answers Bruce, are the mother. Hold on, don't fuck. Is me it? Up. Hold on, I know I'm. You're not points. getting double points. I know, I know, I know. Hold on. Uh, so I think I named everybody. Uh, oh, wait, I said I said the redhead. Did I say Neanderthal man? Mm, Shit, I didn't, I didn't hear that. that. No. Okay, Neanderthal man. Uh, Melissa. I said Melissa. Dr. Cruz. Said that? Why am I helping you? Yeah, I don't know. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Just come on, answer. Dave. Okay. Get competitive. Okay. Fuck. Sorry. It's some I'm going to say nine, Matt. That is incorrect. Shit. Your multiple choices are, is it A, 13, B, 15, C, 11, or D, 12? I'll go to Thir- the bottom. 11. <laughs> That is incorrect. What? It is B-15. What? What the <laughs> fuck did I miss from this movie? Oh, I, wait, the father was killed. And then... I don't know. I wish I had a list here now. Uh, no, yeah, I don't know, the man. Mother, the mother was killed. I said that. Okay, I didn't hear. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. What the fuck? Who else was killed? The fucking douchebag that was trying to bang Melissa. Douchebag? Um, I said him. Star mummy. How about Nick? Did Nick die? No. No, he survived. I question this thing, but okay, let's go on. <laughs> I know it's threats. It's the be all end all. There's nothing we can do. <laughs> all right. Sons of bitches. Uh, the, uh, the, the super duper round. So I'm going to give you a Freddy versus Jason question, okay? Just to make things even. Here we go. Okay. In Freddy versus Jason, what was Jason doing at the beginning? What was he doing at the beginning? Correct. He was fucking in hell chasing a chick to kill her. Stalking. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I guess that's right. You know? You said it weird, but the, there's one word you could say to help this. What was he doing? <laughs> he was killing. Stalking. He's something ing. <laughs> walking. I don't fucking know. Oh, no, you can't get this, dude. Running. Chasing nope. a fucking chick. And, to okay, her. so here's your multiple choice. You're gonna fucking I know he's gonna be punch yourself in the balls here. Is it A burning in hell? B swimming? C hiding in Australia? Or D (laughs) dreaming of his kills? Oh, D dreaming of his (laughs) kills. (laughs) (laughs) There you go. He was dreaming? He wasn't in fucking hell actually doing it? Nope. No, Freddy was in hell Uh at the start of the movie. That fucking movie. Hey, fuck it. I'm tearing this up right now. I still got points. It's okay. It is stupid. Because Freddy turned in, you know, his mom was talking to him, then it became Freddy, so he's obviously dreaming. But how could a dead person dream? Right. So shit, if we're dead and we can still dream, then I'm not, it's not that depressing, because I have some pretty good fucking dreams. So I'm not that depressed about dying, I guess. Yeah, if there this, you go. Nice. Cool. All right, so at the end of round three, Alex, you have 75 points, and Dave C. 135. 105. Shit. So good job. <laughs> so here we go, Alex Edwards. We're in round four, so let's see. These can be worth 40, 40 points potentially. According to Friday the 13th, Part 2, what was Ginny studying at college? Child psychology. Woo! All right! Woo! All right! Bam. There you go. 40 points. Itch! 
Nice. Oh, wait, let me look at the back of the card. Yep, that is correct. Just <laughs> wanted to double check. <laughs> All right, Dave Z. In Friday the 13th, Part 4, A Final Chapter, who won the beer chugging competition at the party? Oh, no. Oh, wow. Um, it's ridiculous. What the fuck's that chick's These name? Questions. Hold on a second. But he could blur out a name and just get it right. Yeah, what was that chick's name? Please be 10 seconds already. Amy? Come was on, man. Was her name Amy? It was definitely a chick. Is it 10 seconds? Mm. All right! Shit. Thank God. Okay. Here we go, Dave. Who won the beer chugging competition at the party? Is it A, Ted, B, Tina, C, Sarah, or D, Terry? It was C, Sarah. That is incorrect. I'm sorry, oh Dave. God. It was Tina. Why the correct you answer that? is Tina. <laughs> Dude, Sarah was looking. Yeah, I don't know. She wasn't even... <laughs> Holy uh, shit. All right, so here we go. Back to Alex. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was between those two girls. <laughs> yeah, dude, it was the twin chug. Yeah. Mm. Remember my song? That's <laughs> <laughs> yes, a get a plaster. <laughs> Don't you have that memorized by now? Jesus. Right? There's so much God. knowledge. You could win this whole game with that song. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right, so here we go. Alex. Mm-hmm. From Nightmare on Elm Street. Series. Here you go. Is this is my fucking winning shot. Mm-hmm. Here you go. Dave's like in it. in a nightmare on Elm Street. What was the number on the pink nightshirt that Nancy wore at the time of Tina's death? Come on. I wouldn't know no matter what you say. Like, is this really my question, <laughs> dude? I twelve. That is incorrect. Your choices are. A eleven, B twenty two, C thirty three, D fifty five. Hold on one second. <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, eleven, uh, twenty two, thirty three, fifty five. Well, the name Scotty Pippen has come up more than one time this week, so I'm going to go ahead and say thirty three because maybe that's destiny calling me. <laughs> That is incorrect. It is A11. It was not. Okay. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, that question sucked ass. Um, Yeah, that was really stupid. Here's the thing. When we ask these questions, I want to lose credibility when I get the wrong (laughs) answer. This is just stupid. Mm -hmm. So go ahead. Uh, Dave Z. In Friday the 13th, Part 4, A Final Chapter... Who did Tina end up sleeping with? Dude, are you fucking with me? Jimmy. Woo! All right! Woo! All right! How, no, come on, Matt. No, that Matt, is correct. I I'm think you should... When you, choosing these. When you look at these questions, you should not let us answer them unless we could lose credibility by getting them wrong. Okay, all right. So from here on out, I'll do that. Oh, that's the end of round that four. It. That's it. Holy shit. Okay, so... Ba, 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 ba. All right. yeah. Now Dave, it's all Friday from now on. Alex, you have 125, and Dave, you have 155 at the <laughs> end of round four. I guess I get them both wrong, and I got to get them both right. Pretty much. Not necessarily. No, these are big points, Alex. Oh, mm-hmm. like 50 and shit, right? Okay. It's like... Yes, your uh, it's shit. worth 50... 50 initially and 25 multiple choice. Okay? Yeah, see? Holy shit. Okay, so here we I'll go. Sh- I'll fucking choke again. Don't worry. It's a big jump. Choke. Choke. <laughs> choke. Choke. <laughs> what do you mean? You don't want me to win? You want to watch Dracula AD and fucking 70? <laughs> I won't pick that. I promise. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> what was the Jeep? <laughs> they're, they're all like, what is the color? What oh, yeah. Is the- that's a loser shit. Like, uh, let's get to the real shit. Yeah, but it's it's kind of tough. Cause some of them are for us are going to be too easy, and the other ones that are hard are going to be too hard, and you're going to yeah. have to guess the multiple choice. That's yeah. the problem. Either we know them right off the bat, or we, or we don't. don't know them at all. Right. So I don't even know if we can weed out the fucking easy ones like, or the hard ones. For example, because, I would know the wheelchair guy was eighty one on his shirt, but I don't know fucking right. anti shirt. You know what I mean? So I don't know. Well, that's Friday, too. You should know it's 81, and right. so should I. I wouldn't have known Nancy either, but we're Friday people. 
Okay. So it doesn't matter. Okay, so here we go. Uh, the start of round five. <laughs> Potentially worth 50 points. Alex Edwards. In Friday the 13th, part three, who was Jason's fourth victim in the movie? Who was his fourth victim? Okay, you got those two. Then you got... I'm going to say it was um, the white biker guy. Do I have to know his name? Isn't it like Loco? That is correct. Yes! Justin. Very good. Yes, Justin. All right, 50 points. Woo! Okay, Dave, here we go. Uh, during Friday the 13th, part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan. Mm. <laughs> what were Tamara and Eva caught doing? Cocaine. Oh. Woo! All right! All right! So easy. Yeah, that was pretty easy. <laughs> but all these five questions are like, what What was the color of the truck? And shit like that. Yeah. So I'm trying to get rid of those. What was the multiple choice there? Finger fucking? <laughs> all, right. all right. So, Alex, this is your final question of the game. I wonder if I'm going to lose this, man. This is literally, I have to get this right, and Dave has to get it wrong. Okay. So, Alex, here we go. Final question of the game. In Friday the 13th, Part 2, what kind of accident did Mark suffer that confined him to a wheelchair? Softball! <laughs> yes! <laughs> he did the thing I did before I had... He actually, the way I rolled into the lounge today is what Mark was doing. He was right. in a motorcycle. And, sorry, there. Ten seconds is up. Uh, you're multiple. <laughs> Stuck it in the ass. No, I'm just kidding. That is correct, sir. Damn. Dave. <laughs> easy. You Fuck, have to get this correct, this. and not only do you have to get it correct, you can't do multiple choice in order oh, to win this. Oh, fuck. So you, Alex, you have 225. Dave has 205. Oh, my. He wins no matter what. I'm trailing, though. No. Oh. No. If you get this right, you got 230. That oh, means you're you right. win multiple no matter what. Help. You have to answer yeah. to win in some All right. Way. All right, get it on. Let's go. Let me just Read. make sure I got this right. Don't filter. Read, monkey. Well, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Dave. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Let me find you an easy one, too. Yeah, right. <laughs> that I fucking stick it. That's what I wanted him to read right away, because I wanted him to read whatever it was. So. Ooh, this oh, one fuck. might be good, but I'm pretty sure you know it. Oh, See, now I'm starting to filter these way too hard. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm worried about. I'm too sorry. It's my fault. I, I started this. Dave Z, are you ready? Yeah, yeah, I'm ready. Final question of the game. You have to get this right in some capacity to win. For all the marbles, who was Jason's father? Oh, come on. Who was Jason's father, huh? Well... <laughs> I tick can't fuck my credit tick bill with up. Are you kidding me? It's tick Elias Voorhees. Woo! All right! All right! That is incorrect. I'm sorry. Mm, nope. The correct answer is Vance. Vance Voorhees. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm, yeah, it is. I'm kidding, Dave. That's worth 50 points. And you're our winner just by a cunt hair over Alex Edwards. <laughs> What was my wrong one again? The fucking shirt that... Oh, I don't remember. Oh, man. Throughout the game, Alex, you missed two and got one off multiple choice. Dave, you missed one and got one off multiple choice. So I'd say that's a pretty good track record for you guys. Well, so, yeah. So you, congrats. you guys definitely don't lose any credibility. So No, no. Dave... Both came down to the last question each week. Mm-hmm. That's pretty good. That's fucking riveting stuff, guys. And that Elias Voorhees one, I waited about eight, nine seconds. He didn't know it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, he didn't know it. He was really thinking. Yeah, man. Yeah, I mean, it takes a second to search stuff on, on your phone. I knew it started with an E. 
That's all I knew. Enough. All right, so Dave Z will get to choose our next installment of Rolling Through the 70s. So stay tuned, and we'll discuss that. And uh, so we'll be back to talk about uh, some Batman versus Superman. Check it out. <laughs>